What, what do you mean they only have 10 calendars left? It's a calendar signing. They've only been here for like an hour. I'll give you 20 bucks for that ticket. No way. How about 50? 50 bucks for that ticket. How about 100 bucks? That's all I got. Not 4,000, buddy. Excuse me. Do you have a light? Um, yeah. I think I got one somewhere. Uh, here you go. Thank you. You're so bad. My agent doesn't want me to smoke, so it sends a bad message. I have to stay around like I'm in fucking high school. Uh, are you uh, done for the day? You're not one of my weird fucker fanboys, are you? Me? A fanboy? No. No way. Good, because I get some real weight. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The last guy in line? Ugh, it's being so creepy. Uh, yeah, I just came by to get an autograph and see if you look as good in person. Oh, really? <laughs> So? So what? So do I look as good in person? Oh, yeah, actually probably even better. And you seem to have a lot nicer personality than I would have thought. Thanks. Would you think I'd be some bitchy supermodel diva? Oh shit, it's my agent. Oh wait, I didn't get your name. Uh, Mike. Okay, yeah. Well, uh, Mike, I'm gonna give you the same piece of advice I give other people. Lads that end up falling asleep across country in hopes of, I don't know what. Just because she's nice to you or signed your calendar or you shared a stink stick or whatever she's done this time. She's not in love with you. And she's never gonna. And five minutes from now when she's at the hotel spa and some big stud of a masseuse has his hands all over her, she's not even gonna remember your name. No, in fact, she may have already forgotten it. I know I have. You know, now I know what she meant by, uh, by saying that her agent was a real prick. <laughs> That's cute. You got a great attitude. For a loser.